Hey there, today I have an Infinitely Loft to unbox. And if you're not familiar with Infinitely Loft, it's a clothing rental subscription service from Loft where you pay a flat $60 a month and you get three items of clothing at a time that is sent to you from your virtual closet that you put together. And you can keep turning around those boxes as many times as you like, but there, but you know, due to time constraints and the turnaround time, it, I typically get about <laughs> three to four boxes a month. But I know if you're very aggressive in turning it around, you could probably get five or possibly even six boxes. But I'll put some information about how the service works down in the description box below, along with my referral link in case you wanna check it out. I'll also put a card up above to my playlist of clothing rental subscription service unboxings. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and see what I got. Okay, so here's what my box looks like inside. And everything's always nicely wrapped. And you have a prepaid USPS mailer to send all your items back after you're done wearing them. And let's take a look at my bundle. It's kind of falling apart. Okay, here, here it is. And as you'll see, it's very red, which is timely because Valentine's Day is coming up in a few days. So hopefully I can get this video filmed and edited before then. Okay, so actually I've had this box for a little over a week, but I wasn't able to open it until today. I just got back from Vegas and LA. I was there um, this past week and oh. <laughs> yesterday uh, we came back. Our flight was supposed to leave at 9 a.m. I think, and it ended up going out at 11 p.m. So we had like a really long delay and by the time we got in, it was like 4 a.m. in the morning. So. It was kind of rough, <laughs> but I had a good nap, so I, ha I think I have enough energy to film this. <laughs> okay, but let's, let's take a look at what I got. The first item in my box is this top. And actually, this is very pretty. It's got like kind of a, a flutter sleeve and a lace detail in the back and kind of a V-neck. So yeah, very cute. Okay, this is the petite lace back flutter cap sleeve shell in rustic red and I just got it in the size small so this is a small petite and I think just based on the way this is cut I think a small petite should work for me normally I pick a uh, medium petite but I was kind of worried about the armholes I'm not too sure about the back though because it hmm, this might not be bra friendly in fact I don't think it is <laughs> but it's um, the buyout price on this and since I already did the return notify I had to jot down the buyout prices before I did it and it's only $11.50 so that is a, a really good price and even though I did the return notify to um, trigger my next box I am able to if I wanted to buy this out I still could email them and they would reset it so that I could buy it out but th that's an excellent price for this very pretty top okay next I have this dress Oh, this is very pretty too. And I really do love red. I mean, not just for Valentine's, but just in general. And it's a size small. I didn't get a petite because I was kind of worried about, you know, how short it would be. And this is the floral smock tie swing neck dress in crimson fire. And you'll see it is a very pretty print and it looks like it, oh, it has pockets, which is always a plus. It has kind of this detail around the waistline and kind of a, oops, this interesting v-neck line with a tie. And I'm not really a big fan of tie necklines to be honest, but it is a pretty print. And this dress, if I were to buy it out, the buyout price was $35.50. Okay, and lastly, oh, I have another pretty blouse. Hmm. And this is in a size small, and this is the floral mixed media tie neck top in Hamptons red and I didn't get a petite size they didn't have petite sizes for this blouse and I just got it in a size small but you'll see like it's a very kind of a flowy oversized blouse it has looks like three-quarter length sleeves are kind of balloony with a um, elastic it looks nice I mean the red is a little bit more on the duller side and this is it's mixed media so this is a, a knit material in the back and to me I don't know if it's coming across as 
a little on the faded side. Yeah, not too bad though. I think as a whole, it's just a more muted color. And this one is $10.50 if I were to buy it out. So that's a really good price. Yeah, but we'll see. I don't know. <laughs> I like the color, but it is a little bit of a faded red. I mean, when you compare it to say this one, you can see the difference. Okay, so that's everything I got in this week's Infinitely Loft box. And it was clearly a Valentine's Day box with all red items. So maybe I could wear, it could be Valentine's every day this week for me since it's Monday today and I took today off since I arrived so late. But yeah, I think I got some nice items and I'm gonna go ahead and try everything on and we'll see how it looks. Okay, so here is the dress. And you know, I think it's cute. It's very flowy a little bit shapeless but I mean I like the color and the print it's a little low in the front so I just pour I have like a tank top underneath and you can tie this but I don't think that looks very good so I just left it open and I like that it has some pockets and it's just a flowy easy to wear dress it hits right above the knee and I think that's that's a good length so let's give it the old denim jacket test. Okay, so here it is with a denim jacket, and this is a dark wash, but you could go with maybe a light wash, medium wash, or even white, and I think it would look nice. So, um, yeah, I think, honestly, giving the, uh, putting a jacket on maybe gives it a little bit more definition to me. <laughs> so I think that looks nice, and I like it. I think this will be a nice, easy to wear, comfortable dress to wear but I don't think I'll be buying it out, but I do think I'll wear it. <laughs> okay, and here is the mixed media top. And yeah, I think this is okay. I do think it looks a little faded, but you know, it is a clothing rental service, so it's probably been worn several times and washed. Um, so you'll see like in the back, it does look a little more faded than the front. And that's just because the fabric itself, it's this is more of a knit material, but I do like it. I think it's cute. It has these kind of um, fuller flowy sleeves. It's, yeah, it's just very flowy. I think it looks good with white jeans and I just have some tan flats. And I think that looks nice and something I could easily wear to work and looks pretty cute, I think. <laughs> so yeah, I think it's another top that I don't think I'll buy it, although I think it was like $10.50, which is a, a crazy good price. But for me, I think it'll just be good for one wear. Okay, and here's the last top. And I don't think this is very bra friendly, but it's a nice, it's a pretty color. And it's just kind of an easy to wear flowy top. I got the small petite and I think it fits okay. There's, it's not as loose and comfortable as I like, but it's not too small, I think. And yeah, I think this looks, it looks nice with some, just some jeans. And these are some very old loft jeans that I have, that I've had for years. And these are some Monroe slides. And I think that looks nice. But anyway, for work, I'd probably add like a, a sweater or a jacket. Okay, and here it is with a blazer and this is this is one that I got from Walmart and it's by Time and True and I actually picked this up at one of, from one of my hundred dollar hauls and I do really like this it's a dupe for a more expensive blazer that you can get from Stitch Fix from French Mauve I kind of wish they had this in more colors at Walmart though they they just had it in black and navy but I think black is just a nice staple so I've actually been wearing this a lot and I do really like it and I think it's just an easy topper but yeah I like the look with a pop of color and just kind of a black jacket neutral with jeans so yeah I think I'll be wearing this this week oh gosh my ankle Ouch. okay so overall I think this was a pretty successful week for infinitely loft I actually did like everything I mean I don't think I loved everything but I thought they were pretty cute and definitely, you know, items that I'll be wearing this week. I mean, this dress, I'll probably wear this tomorrow. I thought it looked good with a denim jacket. 
and I mean I might try it with a, a different instead of the dark wash maybe I'll go with either a medium wash or even like a white denim but I think this is cute this will be uh, Valentine's week for me so today's what the 10th so 11th 12th 13th so it'll be like all week is Valentine's so I'll just need to find one more red thing okay so that's this is definitely something I'll wear probably not purchase but yeah I'll wear this <laughs> I did also like this top I mean I even though you know it does come across as a little faded I think that's maybe just what the shade of red is supposed to be because typically um, polyester doesn't fade that much but it is still I think this is pretty and I thought it looked nice with the white jeans white skinnies and lastly this top even though it's not bra friendly I'm just gonna wear that black blazer over it and I thought this looked very very nice and like a nice punch of color under under the black blazer and with just some dark denim so cute okay so that's all I have for today's video and now I'm going to call my one furry companion right now who's my most devoted friend we just got back I think I mentioned earlier from Vegas and LA and we had been gone a week and <laughs> Kai was so happy she's always she always makes me feel really good because she's so happy to see me when I come home yeah Kaya like she really missed me right Kaya no she doesn't <laughs> come Kaya let's let's help help me say goodbye come come baby come <laughs> Kaya you want to come okay whoa <laughs> and here is Miss Kaya who is just about as sweet as they come I mean she is literally a stuffed animal that came to life I think and she is so sweet and just like the perfect dog I think yeah yeah <laughs> but anyway thanks so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel I do a lot of shopping hauls and unboxing videos and if you enjoy watching those kind of videos please consider subscribing and I'll see you next time bye now yeah Sammy Sammy's upstairs. <laughs>